The screen technology war is raging on multiple fronts. TVs, smartphones, tablets, or monitors are all products on which manufacturers proudly affix an IPS, or FHD, which indicates full high definition, is an acronym used to refer to the 1080p screen resolution in devices. Meanwhile, IPS is an acronym used for describing a type of LED monitor screen technology known as in plane switching monitors, that is, the liquid crystal shifting patterns characterize these monitors. In this video, we'll tell you more about an IPS and Full HD and how to consider them when purchasing your next monitor or laptop. Now let's dive into the deep of this video. What is FHD? FHD is an acronym that means Full High Definition. It's used for describing screens with 1080 pixels format to resolutions. When we talk about mobile device screen resolutions, we often refer to them as HD, Full HD, or FHD. The number of horizontal and vertical pixels that a screen has, which, as you have already seen, is what these terms refer to. Therefore, a resolution should indicate how many pixels a screen has. That is, what pixel density does a screen have? In this, the screen size has a lot to say since a 5-inch Full HD panel is not the same as a 13-inch one. What is IPS? IPS is an acronym for in-plane switching used in LCD to Many smartphone displays are composed of an LCD surface. LCD is a liquid crystal screen. The composition of the crystals on display ensures that the image is clear and distinct for the viewer. Regardless of the type of light falling on the display, the liquid crystals and the display are activated when a voltage is generated. If the user presses a button, the voltage is generated and the display lights up. There are also pixels inside the display. These are points of light and are filled with color. How to make the right decision with LCDS. You can choose between an IPS or a vertical alignment panel. We will show you the advantages and disadvantages of each type. The display on LCD is mainly created and controlled by liquid crystals. Here is the fundamental difference. On VA panels, the crystals are arranged vertically. On the other hand, on the IPS panel, they are arranged horizontally. Which panel is better? VA panels are a bit behind IPS in color accuracy but they are more suitable for gaming scenario. However, with the IPS panel, the crystals are arranged evenly on top of each other, only have to rotate and not move spatially to change the display. This ensures significantly shorter response times with the IPS panel, essential for gaming. Due to the homogeneous arrangement of the crystals, the viewing angle is also significantly larger and more stable. Even if the contrast is higher on the VA panel, the IPS panel provides greater color values. The IPS panel also performs better in terms of power consumption. The TN is nonetheless still a gamer's friend, thanks to its excellent responsiveness, 5ms and less. If a VA panel is touched, it reacts much more strongly to the disturbance and flickers, usually not desired. If you run your finger over the VA panel, you can draw a line for a short time. In the best case, this is not possible with the IPS Still. There is no basis for comparison between FHD and Indeed, you can find a Full HD IPS screen on the market. FHD is a screen format, while IPS is an LED screen tip. The only difference in screen definitions such as FHD is the screens are in vertical and horizontal pixels. At the same time, in IPS panel technology, the displays are composed of liquid crystals arranged in parallel. Now it's your turn. Which one impresses you the most? Let us know in the comment section below. Also. Do share and subscribe to our channel for further video notifications.